love that you took some well-deserved time off. I knew like I needed that summer. I needed it with my kids needed it. Like we just needed a minute. And so um, it was the most wonderful time ever mm -hmm. spent. It was hard to leave. I had several questions in my soul going, why am I leaving? <laughs> do, yeah. do you feel more balanced now? I don't know if balance is the word we should be using because it's never gonna be perfectly balanced, right? Because life ebb and, you know, everything ebbs and flows. Kelly's back from Montana, rested and whooping it up on the cover of Variety. The article asking, can Kelly Clarkson save daytime? Yep, it's a wild time for talk shows. Ellen, Dr. Oz, and Wendy Williams are all off the air. And if you think there's a rivalry brewing between these two, think again. Another American Idol alum, Jennifer Hudson, is doing big things with her own talk show, too. I know. Have you been able to share some words of wisdom for her? I don't feel like she needs words of wisdom because she's awesome, but I definitely texted her and I was like, oh my gosh, so it's a whole different world from like music. But like, if you ever need anything, like let me know. It's just exciting to see. And Sherry Shepard, I'm excited for as well. She's yeah. taking over Wendy Williams, and I'm a, a big fan of hers. We love her here. There's room for all of us, and, and we're only going to lift everyone up. How yeah. do you feel heading into the fourth round of the Kelly Clarkson? Show. I feel like, you know, we're at this point where it's now people know us, you know, like people are, you people know. People have always known you, Kelly. <laughs> well, I mean, but they know, but not everyone, but like, I just mean like they're starting to get to know the show, right? Saw you dancing in a crowded room. Even the Kelly Oakies, people are starting to get to know better. So we're actually having people, it, it, like celebrities, be like, hey, and also if she wanted to do something with the Kelly Oki, I'd be interested. And it's like, wait, what? So it's it, it's just turning into like an even cooler thing. We're talking about some words of wisdom. Do you have any for Miss Camila Cabello as she takes on her red chair uh, near Mr. Shelton? Yeah. You and Gwen would make a great team. What the? I want the best for him. No, you don't. You want the worst for me. Both can be true. Good luck with that. Bring a shield. I think she's going to do well, and I hope she kicks his ass. <laughs> I think she, she has a good chance. I will say, though, we will miss you this season. Oh, was, thank you. It was bittersweet doing the press without you this year, but I'm so happy for you of, of someone from the outside who's always been like, how in the heck are you doing all of these things? Yeah. I'm so glad you were able to take a step back, you know, spend that quality time with your family. Kelly kicks off season four of her talk show with Garth Brooks on Monday. I think people are finally where they belong, and that's together again. Yeah. Uh, that makes me really happy. And she just celebrated a major milestone. Kelly Clarkson. 20 years ago this past Sunday, nearly 23 million people tuned in to watch her become the first American Idol champ. It was a very emotional day, and I just, you know, had just been weeping all day for a different reason, and then all of a sudden it hit me. I was like, oh my God, it's September 4th. It's crazy. It's, there's no, there are no words to describe how fortunate you feel.